Jesus. Fair for your honest sonsy face. Great chieftain of the pudding race. A boon them all, you take your place. Pence tripe with them. We lie your worthy or a grace as lands my eye. The groaning trench of there you fell. Your heart is like a dust on hell. Your pen would help to mend the mill in time of need. While through your pores the dews distill like amber bead. His knife, see rustic labour decked. You see that? And cut you up with ready slicked. Trenching a gusher and child pricked like on a dick. And then, oh, what a glorious sect. Warm, reeking, <laughs> and rich. <laughs> then horn for horn they stretch and strive. Deal tack the hindmost on they drive. Till all their wheels while kites be live are bent like drums. And our good man must like to ride. Be thank you, Hans. <laughs> is there that o'er his French ragout, or olio that would stow a sou, or fricassee that would mack a spew with perfect sconner? Looks doon. With sneering scorn for view on sick a dinner. Poor devil, see him o'er his trash, as feckless as a withered rash, his spindle shank and good whip lash is neither knit through bloody flood or field to dash, oh how unfit. But mark the rustic haggis fed, <laughs> <laughs> the trembling earth resounds his tread. <laughs> Trapping his wally neighbor blade, he'll mack it whistle. And legs and arms and heads will snid like traps of bristle. <laughs> he powers what make mankind your care. And dish them with their bit of fit. Oh, Scotland wants no skinking wear the jobs in luggies. But if you wish, a grateful praise. Here, a haggis. Well done, Paddy. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>